Now the King's Stand stakes is next then. This is a five foot on Group 1. And I guess from next season this is going to be renamed the King Charles stakes, the same as it is in real life. It's a five foot on Group 1. And at the top we've got Blessed for Joshua Sutherland, Gixie Speedster, Vinnie Gerard, Man Chones, Darren Thompson, Roman Warrior, and Sierra Blanca, both for Paul Rhodes. Tylos Oiled for James Shea, Yama Twister, Vinnie Gerard, Betty Boop. David Robertson, Magical, Joshua Sutherland, South Island for Munas, and Crypt for Rod McClure. So 11 in this sprint then. All installed and ready to go. And away they go. And down on this near side rail, South Island was quickly out, but one or two pulling for their head. The two Joshua Sutherland horses want to get near the lead as well. So too does Sierra Blanca and Roman Warrior, the two Paul Rose horses. And now Manchones is coming through as well. And it's probably going to be Manchones who's going to be the one who's got the lead from right over on the far side. I think that's Sierra Blanca, one of the Paul Rose horses. Blessed and Roman Warrior are next. Then Gixie Speeds is after that. Crypt and Tylos all have been taken off their feet, but they're already past halfway. And it's Manchones and Speedy Gixie Speedster in the green is now just come through to take it up from Manchones Magical is throwing down a big challenge as well Sierra Vista is still there as well then comes Yama Twister Betty Boot trying to get into it but it's Gixie Speedster with a fur to go Gixie Speedster from Magical Blessed is still trying to get close then Yama Twister Gixie Speedster hanging on from Magical Gixie Speedster from Magical down on this near side Yama Twister it's got to be a head bobber as they get to the line it's close the two Vinny Gerard horses have flashed past the post together and I've been saying for a while, what are we going to do if we get a dead heat with the same trainer? Is he going to get two winners? Well, that could be a case in point here. It is. It's a dead heat. Gixie Speedster and Yama Twister. Dead heat for Vinnie Gerard. So does he get two wins in the title race? I'm guessing he's going to have to, otherwise it's not going to be fair. But that's going to be something that the old rule book people are going to have to figure out. Magical second, magical third even for Joshua Sutherland. Tylos Oiled was fourth for James Shea and blessed for Joshua Sutherland was fifth. So drama and excitement already then. And that's just the second race of Royal Ascot. Vinnie Gerard dead heated with himself to end up giving himself two wins instead of just one.